Right, so the 20 years declined. 20 it? years, not all necessarily yours. It, not it has not all. Said. No, I've only been doing it for uh, seven, I think, seven years. But yeah. you've got two big names in this episode coming up. Two big names. And they, are you the names you would be referring to are... Uh, oh, Anita Harris. Yes, I, was sh I suddenly thought, is this a secret, and then? Sorry, no, no, you, put you just put you on the that. spot. Well, you, you put me on the spot and I've always oh, had that thing with names. <laughs> you think, oh, what's that? Uh, <coughs> Anita Harris is in it, which I was very thrilled yes. by, and Elaine Page. Two great who's, names. Who's very wonderful. It sounds like it's a, it's quite a sort of uh, music, song and dance kind of episode, but I don't think it is. It's about um, it's about a brewery and monks drowning and... and um, yeah, the ghost of Causton Abbey. The ghost of Causton Abbey, yes. yes. Some, something terrible happens to somebody in a big vat quite right near the beginning. Fear. Excitement um, turns to fear when a man is found boiled to death yeah. in one of the beer vats. Are you allowed to say that? That's a, yeah, a not, spoiler, spoiler alert. Well, <laughs> what a we way to go. So, we are allowed, we check. Yes, boiled to death. It's it's just boiled to death. Boiled. Boiled to yeah. death. It'll be all the, the hops bubbling uh, away. Boiling away at the hops. Yeah. Otherwise, I suppose you just drink your way out, wouldn't you? <laughs> <laughs> just guzzle it up. Um, it out. 20th anniversary. 20 series. I know. It's, yeah. um, it's astonishing, isn't it? It started, I think, in something... I can't remember. Well, 20 years ago. Uh, but it started in 96, <laughs> didn't it, I think? We've had a year off for yeah. good behaviour. We, we didn't film last year. Um, but, yes, and this, this is will be the 20th series. This is my seventh, seventh, yeah. seventh series, I think. Yeah. Yes, I, I took over in uh, series yeah. 14 from yeah. Dear John Nettles. Yeah. I used to think that they were all murders that happened in the middle of summer. <laughs> I didn't realise. So I thought they were midsummer murders, yeah. and I thought, you know, it was like the temperature rises and everybody goes <laughs> mad type thing. Like everybody gets easy it. mistake. It. But, yes, um, yes but, that but, would have been. No, no, it's not. Now, uh, <laughs> Barnaby has yeah. a partner, and his partner is um, uh, DS Jamie Winter. Yes. Right, tell me about the relationship between these guys and how it develops. In, in, uh, you know. Well, I think it starts off. Um, I think Barnaby finds uh, Winter, although he's done. Hang on, no, he's already done. How many series has he done? He's done two series, I think. Um, he, uh, yes, they start off a bit sort of tetchily. I think Barnaby, Barnaby kind of gets a bit of a, a bromance with his previous partner, and then that partner leaves and he goes into a grump, and then somebody else, some young whizzy type, arrives and they're all <laughs> sort of too clever and they know how to work the internet and all that sort of thing. So he gets a bit cross with them while his wife says, Oh, just give them time and that sort of thing. Uh, and then, of course, they do something marvelous like save his life before the end of episode one, and then he's sort of having a big bromance with them. So we start off having a, we started off having a little bit of a, a, a kind of a, a, a fight with each other and then became tremendous uh, pals. And now also it changes as well, because now as I get older, and the sergeants get younger, the relationship uh, of, becomes more of a sort of mentor-mentee, is that yeah. the word? Um, you know, pupil, um, teacher-pupil yeah. sort of yeah. thing. Um, so uh, that, that sort of changes the, the dynamic between them. But it's still, it's always a, a kind of a... A fun relationship, a sort of... I think what the young people now refer to as bantering, eh? Bants. It's the bants. We have a bit of bants, Get a I bit of bants. I'm not, I'm not altogether sure what that um, is, but I'm sure we have it. There's a new face, a, a new pathologist, played yes. by Annette Badland, um, Fleur yes. Perkins. Fleur Perkins. So yes. she's in to shake it up a bit. What's yes, your reaction well, she, to again, her? You see, I think they like the sort of feisty relationship with Barnaby. I think they, they don't want him to become too comfortable or complacent, so they bring in people to sort of prod him with a stick and make him a bit uncomfortable. And Annette, being brilliant, has come in with this lovely character, Are Fleur Perkins, who uh, oh. is she here? And she, um, uh, there she is. And she, uh, she sort of challenges him and tests him, and if he says, I want that on my desk by tomorrow morning, she says, you'll get it when it's good and ready and not before. And he says, oh, <laughs> oh well, thank you, thank you, that's, that's fine, thank you. Well, um, so they have a bit of a sort of uh, a feisty relationship. But again, they, their, their mutual respect grows and, um, you know, they, they, they get along very well as the series progresses. And she has a very interesting sort of hinterland as a character. She's always coming out with things that are sort of quite... that shock Winter yeah. and Barnaby, because she says, oh, you know, my... Yeah, yes, my boyfriend came off his motorbike last night and I've been at the hospital all night and, you know... Well, it's the drugs, <laughs> I suppose. And, you sort of, you know, and she sort of glosses over these... What on earth is going on in this mysterious life she has away from pathology? Uh, uh, on, but she's great. On the subject of testing, um, I oh, believe... It's a quiz. Uh, is it true that there are, like, clues in there or... Hidden treats for fans, references to Super previous fans. episodes. No. No, <laughs> it's not. Uh, no, I think that's the second episode, which I think is not the episode going out this Sunday. I think the episode going out the following Sunday. As a special treat for the great fans of the show, there are 20 what they've confusingly called Easter eggs, mm -hmm. like an Easter egg hunt. They've hidden little things in the, the second show 
uh, which refer back to incidents, locations, murders, things from the previous 20 years of of shows, like 134 episodes, something like that. So if you're a great big super fan of the show, you'll be watching the show thinking, oh, that refers back to the to the episode when somebody yeah. fell in a... It's an extra little added... It's an added little thing, but I don't know quite... I don't know whether they're going to do it over Twitter or whether there's going to be something in the TV Times that you get a little we'll check. checklist... We'll, we'll check. While we're, while we're checking, let's yes. have a look. Um, this Sunday, um, 8 o'clock, this is the ghost of Corston Abbey. Mm. I was here yesterday. They were doing a free beer tasting. I wouldn't sample their current batch, sir. Do we know who he is? Now, the owners think that it's local writer Adam Asoba. He's been working with them on a book about home brewing. They've ID'd him from his signet ring and his, um, his bag's been found, but the actual body... What? Well, they didn't tell you. It's not just a drowning. It looks like he's been boiled to death. Between yeah, we're just we're just talking about exactly where mid where? midsummer is, and he's not sure as it's a detective where? he's it's lost. Well, it. It's not it's exactly in one, but it's a it's a huge <laughs> county. It covers a large area as we do when we're filming. So it's yeah. kind of it covers an area of South Oxfordshire, Buckinghamshire, Berkshire. We get around, you know. Yeah. We, we were, somebody just said to me, "Oh, there's a lot of murders in that village." I said, "It's not a <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's a, a county. Village. It's a bit ridiculous." And if you yeah. have 350 murders, and it doesn't happen really. just in summer either. Not just in summer. In the middle of the summer at that. <laughs> uh, Neil, program, welcome yeah, back. So. Welcome back Thank you. Um, to all of that. It's Thank the you. 20th anniversary series yes. of Midsummer yes. Murders, yeah. and uh, it's the Ghost of Coston Abbey, episode one. With Sunday a lame page. Night, With o'clock. a lame page and Anita Harris. And, and, yeah. Anita Harris. and, and lots of other people. Thank you. And you, of course. Oh, yeah, there's me. I'm in it. No. <laughs> Don't let that put you off. Thanks, Neil. Good to see you, Neil. Thank, Thank you. Good to have you back.